A local church is putting a new spin on the biblical tale of Cain and Abel, transforming it over the past year into more like walking Cain and being Abel. Cedra Mayfield showing us how those with special medical needs are getting the help they need in this week's Tell Me Something Good. Some go to church for prayer, others for spiritual guidance. First Presbyterian Church of Holt. But at First Presbyterian Church, a growing number of people are coming for bath seats. Bath seats have been a really hot item lately. We uh, don't have too many of them because as soon as they come in, they tend to go out. Reverend Becca Zorg Dagger pastors at the church where its congregation runs a medical lending closet. We currently have um, commodes, bath seats, wheelchairs, walkers. There are a lot of people that can't afford medical equipment or maybe they have something that happens temporarily, they have to have surgery, they break a leg, uh, they just need some help. It's expensive, insurance doesn't always cover everything. Whether it be crutches or walkers, all equipment in the medical lending closet is free to borrow. It's an easy thing, they just call the church. If we've got it, we let you know. You come sign a paper, pick it up, and it's yours for as long as you need it. Free access that wouldn't be possible without donations. The things that we have to lend out, people have brought in. And generosity of the community. One church member opening his garage next Next door to help store more medical equipment. Every six months to a year, we'll just check in. Are you still using it? If someone needs it for a decade, fine. Helping make sure a lack of medical equipment doesn't become a crutch for those in need. In Holt, Sedra Mayfield, 6 News.